January 2024 I've been putting this off for uh, several months well since mid-August 2023 um, but I've been meaning to do it I just not had the uh, window and then obviously with the winter we've not had particularly good weather conditions we just had storm Isha and we were just about to get storm Jocelyn so in between the two I thought I'd go out for a little walk. So, if you're renting lots of bikes, action, I mean, not hardly any more than what you're seeing now, um, but it's actually a follow up to some stuff that we were doing during the summer. A bit different, I hope you enjoy and uh, see what it's like around here, but not exactly on the roads. As I say, if you don't want to watch it, that's fine. I won't worry, but if you are interested, I do hope it's uh, you find it worthwhile. Damn, somewhat faster than a Royal Enfield. It's dreadful, it's dreadful. Okay, so there's a beautiful cottage and the Oakwood Centre. Nice, isn't it? There's snow on top. going to see if I can find um, I'm actually in uh, the Oakland Valley Blowing a gale, it's just the uh, remnants of Storm Isha. And I'm on a bit of a mission to see if I can, uh, how can I put this, make amends for a bit of a competition I placed with some friends of mine, Los Peridosos, and um, see if I can actually show them the answer to the question that I gave. I pose for them. Well, first of all, here's a clue. That there be a uh, probably World War Two, I'm guessing installation. The Home Guard defended the Ogden Valley during World War Two. And there's a pillbox that I tried to see if Los Peridosos could uh, spot it, but they all failed. So I'm trying today to go on a quick mission to see if I can show it to them. Whether I succeed is another matter because, as you can see, it's fairly, uh, yeah, fairly wet and difficult terrain. Interesting bridge though, you can see the old original bridge underneath the new one yeah so my original thoughts were I'd be going up this path but it doesn't really look like it's gonna happen that's a bit dangerous the one slip and I've had it and I'm on my own there's no phone signal here and uh, I'm not willing to take the risk. So I might try and go a different route. Let's see what happens. Attempt number two to go and find the pill box that I insist exists. Should be good fun. So, getting the bearings, we're now at the far end of Linogwen. And we're following the slate trail 
but that way to the left it's all very pretty there's the lake Slain, whatever you want to call it let's see what happens our first proper view of the lake Slain Ogwin this will be a lovely uh, green lane unfortunately it's our walkers only you can hear the wind's gone up Rolls up in that valley up the top. We're heading over there, in theory. Okay, I'm going to turn you off for a while because of the noise. It's beautiful. This part of the uh, path is still the uh, Slidonia Slate Trail, but. Uh, it is one of the parts that's pedestrian access only as you can gather but it seems to be quite well way marked quite a bit blowy imagine the uh, home guard coming out here to guard on a cold January night in fairness it's not that cold today although it's January 2024 it is mighty blowy right we'll carry on for a bit longer some form of electrical insulator there are uh, overhead cables just up there so that's probably what that is oh well, that's interesting right we're heading that way this gives you an idea of some of the terrain up here There's been um, some water going on to the old mountains. Where can they go down them? Down that side. All I've got to do is get across it. It's not easy when you're trying to carry a camera. It's a lot easier earlier. Right, now I'm not sure which way here I'm supposed to be going. Oh, 
that is deep mud. Right, I think what we'll do is we'll go round. I don't want to trap myself in it. Ooh. Yeah, that was deep. <laughs> oh dear. Never mind. Right, you join me coming up to yet another way marker in the style, possibly soon after. Now you can see why I left it, even though it's still quite early. Sunset's not due for another couple of hours. It's already starting to get quite dark. If anything was to go wrong, I'd be in trouble. So the plan is stay safe, get out of here quickly, sooner rather than later. I don't know if the camera is picking this up, but you might be able to see blue pipes in the river. That'll be the private water supply for one of the buildings. They won't be on Main's water here. Oh, dee -dee. Go. There's another one. Right. Daylight waits for no man. So we need to crack on. We're actually quite close. To, uh, to the roads. Just don't feel like it. Because they do actually show you where you're supposed to be going. Really. Sounds horrible. That's another pretty little stream.
got to be careful be easy to lose your footings well I've got to say although I'm disappointed I'm not surprised that I haven't been able to get there today it was always a bit of a long shot it would have been good to see inside but hopefully we've got a feeling for what it's like to try and get there in winter I'll have to try another day when I've actually got time before we lose daylight sounds like a Ducati going up there very flat sounding the twin sort sound of you that are interested no more sports no camping no fires are allowed keep your dogs on leads no littering obviously uh, and no drones it's actually a bylaw and you're not allowed to use drones here so uh, yeah there you go so we're just going to head back to the car down the path it's all good isn't it well it's been a bit different this one well it's not been very different I've just failed at doing something but uh, slightly different activity I'm not hill fit at all by any stretch of the imagination but today is just blowing holy it's horrible if I could have got the other the other way I'd be done dusted and back home by now I think 